today we're at Suvi's Journalism and today we will be doing... So, here is young Spencer, three month old Spencer. This is the baby bouncer he has been using. Now that was Amity's baby bouncer nine years ago. Mm, yep, Still mine. in reasonably good condition. I mean, of course, we'd normally connect him up there. But the back, the material's starting to sag a little bit. He's sinking a little bit. And Spencer said, I want my own baby bouncer. So, mm. we have gone to baby bunting. Oh, sorry. And we have chosen this one here, a Nuna Leaf Grow Baby Bouncer. So we are going to unpack it and see how much, if any, assembly is required. First step, if Spencer will allow us, is to just get him to rest down here for a minute. Oh, sorry, boy. Stay. Stuck you in. While we open the box. So, let's look at the box here. These sort of things always creates a lot of mess. Definitely. We'll just put it in the corner for a moment. I'm and then that. Later. So, what does that say? Sit back and sway away. Wow, that sounded promising. Okay, so we've opened the box. This is what we see so far. Ooh. Now, maybe should light on its, perhaps should light on its side. What's inside? I wonder what well, could be. Or maybe stick the whole thing up. Let gravity do the work. So this bit is a bit hard. What do you think so far, Spencer? This bit is a bit hard. Ooh! Largely pretty simple. So back to here, Spencer. Looks like we've got the main part of this thing. Ooh. And then, along with the toy that comes with us, and then this must be the base here. So, down to the cut. Down to the cut these plastic straps. So, just go get the standing knife. Spencer, what do you think of this zipper? Be very careful, do not cut your hands. Put the some of the boxes and so let's get out the base first. Check the plastic. And there's another layer. And always guys remember to recycle as much as physically possible. Yeah. I know the recycling situation is a bit dire at the moment in Australia, but we should still be encouraged and we should recycle as much as possible. So let's move this off. So this is clearly the base here. And then Uh, baby bounces. So we've got the base. Looks like it's minimal assembly required, actually. In fact, it looks like pretty much this just needs to be attached. Attached onto here. Let me rotate it around a little bit. Rotate it. This is where I might have to look at the structures to see. Yeah. It's nice when it's meant to rotate. There it goes. Wow. Oh, there we go. Did oh. you do it? That's right. This was meant to be here. Now, dog, this seat. <laughs> Piper, Piper, it's not yours. Sit, sit. Yes, shake, ha shake not hands. Not yours. Okay, not this is Spencer's new seat. This is not yours. So and let's that, unwrap this little ribbon. And it even has a turning function. Nope, this it's is, um, No, this is Piper, sit. Stay. Okay, so this is just a little bit of an advertisement really for it. Bet they don't need to advertise for us anymore because we've already bought it. Okay, so this it here. Has a so have a look at this. So this is so you can adjust the, the angle. So, By adjusting. So it can go as low as this or as high as this. Now obviously we want Spencer to be sitting up a bit so we can see the room and also after feeding to help him with this. So there's these straps here. Amity, would you please film this rather than the dog? There's plenty of opportunity to film the dog being naughty, but there's not that much opportunity to film this being unpacked. It's very first time. 
And then this strap here, this Velcro strap, probably needs to be enlarged a little bit. It's probably a little bit tight. So, enlarge it to say probably, probably about there. By the way, this is actually certified up to 60 kilos. I can't even lay in it. For, so Amy, I certainly can't. It's been a very, very long time since I've been 60 kilos. Um, so once again, just loosen the strap a little bit. So probably about there, nice strong GoPro one. So just looking back down here. So once again, this is the, so this thing here is the lock. So you put it in there in that place and it doesn't rotate back and forth much. You unlock it and it rotates back and forth. It's meant to rotate up for about two minutes with the baby on it. We'll put Spencer to a test. Um, so, sorry, the lowest level. Push down, one, two. So I think it's got three levels. One, two, oh, sorry, two, three. Yes, so there's three different levels. So we'll have it at its highest. Okay, and this is the toy that goes with it. It's very simple to attach. It's very simple to attach. It's a little toy mobile. Keep Spencer entertained. Okay, Spencer, shall we test it out? Okay, so let's just slide you in here. Legs under. It's probably about right. In fact, we probably might make it slightly. Oh, oh. We might make it slightly tighter. Okay, Spencer's saying I'm not used to this. What we might do is we might try the back and forth function. So we'll unlock this and, and, and then set him to swing. And we'll see if this pacifies him. Swing, 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 swing. Spencer's going, oh, actually, he gave a little smile then. Spencer's going, hey, actually, this isn't too bad. Maybe, might take a little bit of getting used to. In fact, I think he wants these closer. So let's move these up closer. That's a good thing about this, you can just move them up closer. Go. And the dog's helping them swing. Are you helping them swing or are you just having a nose? And, and so we, we can set Spencer to swing and there he goes, back and forth. And so Spencer gets a nice good view of the room with this. And this is actually a cushion for comfort, but beneath it you can easily remove this cushion, especially when they're a little bit older, but you can even do it at this age. And under here, as you see, it's just netting. So easy to clean and also then in hot weather, actually to be fair today might be a good day to start doing it. It allows more airflow through, through here. So there you go. This is the Leaf, the Nuna Leaf Grow Baby Bouncer. Bouncer.